before. The rules-based order... Yeah, what's the difference? The, the rules-based order is a, a set of ever-varying and const constantly vacillating uh, rules devised by the United States for the benefit of the United States and its Western allies. Uh, a, a very good example, of course, is the, the, the United States claim, and our claim, uh, in the Red Sea that the actions they're taking are upholding, and Richard Mayle said this himself, Australia must uh, support the United States and the UK because we must uphold the freedom of navigation. The, the, uh, United, Nations, the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea uh, is not what the United States is attempting to uphold no. at all. It is attempting to uphold the, the right of the Western powers to uh, continue their navigation wherever they please. Mm. Uh, the United States is not even a signatory to the Law of the Sea Convention and repudiates it quite frequently. Uh, so uh, I personally am, am quite distressed by this glib um, approach of the Australian government of always insisting that we must uphold the rules-based order. Um, <clears throat> because one of the most difficult things about the rules-based order is finding out what the rules are. The ever-changing rules. The ever-changing rules.